For practice at self check 5.24 scanner values, we are given the following code and we are asked what is the output when the user types the following values. We don't need to type the prompt, just the user input. We just need to write the lines of output that would appear after the user is done typing and presses enter. Okay, so to start this out, we look at this first line and it just declares a scanner, so there's nothing about this line. Then this line prints out a prompt. Now we have an if statement to make sure it is a integer. So if it's an integer, it's going to be in here. We can say int for this. If it's anything other than an integer, it's going to be in the else statement. So the first thing we're going to look at is Jane, and it will fall in our else statement because it's not an integer. So we have string token is equal to console.next, and our string is just going to be Jane because it's the console.next, it's the next thing that's input. So it's going to say your name is, and then the token. So this will be the output. Your name is, and then Jane. If we do this here, we can write and then submit that, and we can see that that part is correct. Now if we look back at it, we have this 56, and this 56 is an int, so it's going to be in this int part, and this is if console.hasNextInt, int, which it does, we're going to be in here, an int number is set to console.nextInt, so our int's going to be stored in this number. Now we have a system.out.println line where it prints out your IQ is plus the number, which is 56. So 56 will be right here, and if we print this, it'll be your IQ is, and then 56. That passes. And then lastly, for 56.2, if we look in here, all we have is an int, and then we have an any. This is a double. However, since it's not an int, and we don't have an if statement for a double, it's going to be taken as a string. So we have console.next, and then it's just going to print out your name is, and then our double right here. So we can just copy this and then replace Jane with 56.2. If we submit this, we can see that we've passed the test. And this is the answer for the following code. Again, the last reason why this part, even though it's a number, is not passed into int is because it's a double. And this else statement, or this else if statement, takes care of anything. Even though it's an integer or a double or whatever, if we have a dot next this dot next will consider it as a string and take it as that so that is the answer to this problem